Um, I would like to ask the court for um, a million dollar bond just on Mr. Bissell's prior records, the fact that he fled the scene, he was inebriated, and he killed my father. It was back in November when a daughter made an emotional request after her father, firefighter Johnny Tetrick, was run over and killed. However, a judge didn't agree. She said bond for Leander Bissell at five hundred thousand dollars. Hey, you said your cuff was tight. You said the cuff was tight. The forty-year-old was arrested hours after the crash on Cleveland's east side. Police say he went through barricades set up along I-90, barricades up because of an accident. Tetrick there helping out. 19 News uncovered new information in the case. Bissell wrote a letter to Judge Timothy McCormick asking to have his bond reduced, an unusual request because it was not a formal motion filed by an attorney, and it wasn't considered since Bissell was already currently serving an 18-month mandatory sentence on unrelated drug charges in addition to charges in Tetrick's death. An emotional service for the 27-year fire veteran attended by thousands in Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse. You had the following verse written on his helmet. Friends and family of the Cleveland firefighters showed up in the courtroom today. However, the proceedings were not on the record. Bissell has his next pretrial scheduled for later this month. Reporting in Cleveland, Vic Gideon, 19 News.